Central Wisconsin BMX is considered to be one of the best kept secrets in Wisconsin Rapids, but riders never intended on keeping it hidden. Newsline 9's David de Guzman brings us to a venue in Wisconsin Rapids that doesn't even have an address. Oh, and they can hear us on race day and they're like, when you were, how long have you been there? You know. So. The answer is 10 years. For the last decade, Central Wisconsin BMX has settled at its hidden location, right across from a Home Depot off of Highway 54 in Wisconsin Rapids. But people still are surprised that we're here. Yeah. <laughs> you know, they, they once they come or they hear about it, they're like, we didn't even know. Here, athletes as young as four and as old as 62 ride along a track filled with jumps and narrow turns. Oh, you get up there and you're just like, Oh, this is a really big hill, those jumps are kind of big. Then you kind of go over it and you get a feel for it and then it just becomes natural after you do it so many times. Central Wisconsin BMX started 25 years ago by a motorcycle racer named Bill Dickerson, who became the first track operator in Wisconsin Rapids. And I, I could see that it was something that could grow and with this happening here and all the kids that I used to race with, some of the kids I took to the races, their kids are racing here today. Bill Dickerson is considered to be the godfather of Central Wisconsin BMX, and he says the best part of it all is seeing this family of riders continue to grow. It's, we're on a track, we're racers. Off the track, we talk about anything or everything or their bikes or whatever. We help each other. It's As Dickerson approaches his 59th birthday, he says he'll continue to race as long as he can at a location that he hopes won't remain hidden much longer. In Wisconsin Rapids, David Guzman, Newsline 9 Sports.